Hi everyone, my name is Ilya and today we will be testing different apps for 3D head and body scanning. I will be doing it using my iPhone XS, but some of these apps are available for Android phones too. I will show you 5 different apps, how I use them and what I've got in the end, so you can draw conclusions by yourself. Let's start in 3D. Let's start with the app I personally worked on. The scanning process is a two-step. You first scan the head and then scan the body. AI Assistant helps you throughout the process so you won't be lost. One thing you need to keep in mind is the lighting. You need to face the light source while scanning to ensure the best quality. You can export the 3D module as a file or you can play around with it in the app. There are animations, export to several games and virtual try-on. I can dress myself in different clothes, it is my favorite feature. Capture A beautiful app. You know how to get started right away. You need to be careful while scanning and sit still, otherwise the scan will be noisy. The result is quite good for the head, but it's a point cloud so you need to post-process it if you want to work with the triangle mesh. I tried to scan my body, but the tracking algorithm is very fragile and cannot track human motion. Polycam I asked my assistant to take 20 photos of my head from different angles. This process took about 3 minutes. The app sends photos to the cloud and returns a mesh. Maybe we were doing something wrong, but I did not manage to get a nice result on the first try. We were also unable to scan the body because our room was too small. DDMO this is a great app, the easiest to use. It creates your 3D model from a single photo. But the model is a little unrealistic and uh, here is mine. The application seems to be under active development because there are lots of features that haven't been released yet, so it will definitely get better someday. Bellos 3D The scanning process is straightforward, you just have to follow their guide. The result is excellent, I like it. Good scan quality, fast results and a good level of detail. While there are not many features in the application, you can change light and put a mask on your face. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. Let me know which app worked best for you. See you soon.